Hello and welcome to this weekend edition of the Daily Dose of Greek. And today we're going to talk about a resource. We're going to talk about this advanced or reference grammar by Heinrich von Siebenthal, right? Heinrich von Siebenthal, the title of the English translation of this grammar, is Ancient Greek Grammar for the Study of the New Testament, published by Peter Long Publishers. This is, of course, a translation of the original German edition that came out in 2011, the English translation coming out in 2019. Now, when you talk about advanced or reference grammars specifically for the New Testament, there really is not a, a large selection of those. Right? Traditionally, people say, what's an advanced reference grammar for the New Testament? You know, something where you use to look up more detailed things. That's something you're probably going to sit down and read through. Uh, probably the first one on the list people think about is BDF, right? Blast, Brunner, and Funk. But it's quite old. It's originally translated from German and updated slightly by Funk. But you have BDF, Blast, Brunner, Funk. You might also think of the multi-volume work by Moulton Howard Turner, MHT. But that also is very dated. Robertson's Large Reference Grammar, A.T. Robertson's Large Reference Grammar, which is also you know, nearly 100 years old, the uh, uh, the the first edition more than a hundred years old but but the, the you know the final edition nearly a hundred years old of that and then you might think of Dan Wallace's uh, Greek grammar beyond the basics which is an intermediate grammar but is so detailed um, that it really kind of bridges the gap between intermediate and, and reference grammar so there's not a huge huge field of contenders out there and so when there's a a new advanced or reference grammar specifically for the New Testament that's an exciting day. I, I had heard about this grammar for some time, the, the German version of it. I, I had it on my shelf. I confess <laughs> I kept waiting to ha have the gift of interpreting interpretation, <laughs> my German being so poor, to, poor. I kept hoping that would that would come and I'd be able to, to read the, the German reference grammar more easily. But now that there's an English edition, I don't have to, to worry about that anymore, right? I've only skimmed through it. I have not read it in detail because reference grammars usually you don't do that. But it seems to me that it's very, very helpful. It's updated for current discussion. It's um, lots of examples. It's nicely formatted. So I'm excited about it. I imagine when I have a doctoral seminar in the future, specifically focusing on Koine Greek grammar, I very, very likely could have the students uh, get this and we might we might I might force all of us to read through it and discuss it but just wanted to make you aware of it a new reference or advanced grammar for the New Testament is always an occasion to celebrate and so now you can go celebrate knowing about Siebenthal's new Greek grammar